Hey guys, I just want to do a quick update on uh, the tank, or I should say tanks. Um, I'm to close my door here real quick. Uh, so, I went to a uh, pet store, the fish store today in Lansing, and uh, I got uh, traded in my, whoa, traded in my, um, <coughs> Albino, uh, Elrica Red, uh, for a, uh, Sunshine Peacock, which he is, right, oh, no, he's hiding, oh, there he is, um, he's about the biggest one in the tank right about now, uh, definitely the most skittish, and the most chicken, for everybody, um, he's actually like my electric poo Jack Dempsey, uh, kind of bully him a bit. I had to take out the, if you notice, I had a, t a couple fish missing, uh, because, uh, they're in fishy timeout. Uh, the Severum didn't like him, and neither did my German Red or Taiwan Reef, or, uh, not Taiwan, wow, or, um, Yellow Blaze. So, uh, they're out for a little bit. Um, also, uh, Third gallon is going to be changed. Um, there's an auction coming up, and uh, I'm getting a group of uh, some tangy and hiki and cichlids. So, uh, to start me off, but um, I went to the fish store today and I saw some cool uh, compressor uh, uh cichlids. A uh, very beautiful, nice big male that uh, I really want now. He had nice um, color. He had a gold head, so it was pretty cool. Um, also, uh, while the light in the room is on, let me show you. Ooh, sorry, uh, these guys. Their light is turned off. Uh, cause I just decided to turn the light off. But um, while the bed, well, my uh, bedroom light is on, uh, these all are going to a new home. Uh, the plants are going to stay. I have some black stand, sand downstairs. Um, <clears throat> sorry if I sound crappy because I'm kind of uh, got, I think, a cold. But um, anywho, uh, these guys are all going to a new home. Um, uh, mm, hold on one second. I got to put the camera down. Sorry guys. <laughs> okay, anywho, um, so these guys are going <coughs> all to a new home, and then, um, <coughs> excuse me, uh, I'm going to put, um, black sand over the substrate because I'm going to move the electric blue jack Dempsey and the catfish back in here, and, uh, keep all the plecos in the third gallon. Uh, I figured they'll be fine with the Tanganyikin cichlids. So, uh, yeah, um, I'm hope, my plan is to hopefully have some, uh, sand, uh, ooh, like this type of sand <coughs> in the 30 gallon, <coughs> uh, before, uh, I get the Tanganyika cichlids, but if not, oh well, um, but, uh, hopefully, uh, with the rest of my Christmas money, I can use that to get some sand, or maybe some fish, or maybe both, so, um, so yeah, uh, everything's doing really good, uh, the sunshine, I really do like him a lot, which, where did he go? <laughs> Not sure where he went, but I really do like him a lot. I'm glad I got him. Oh, I see him. He's underneath there. He's hiding. Um, but I do really like him a lot. He, uh, it's the biggest uh, peacock in here. Um, I'm hoping when I <coughs> introduce, back introduce the, uh, 
uh, yellow blaze and uh, and German red that they accept him because if they don't I don't know what I'm gonna do um, he's really pretty I really like him his yellow um, it's actually quite peaceful he doesn't seem to bother anybody in here so um, also uh, I did an, a video of my yellow blaze and the female um, uh, deep water hat breeding but I decided not to upload it because uh, when I was talking I just didn't like the way I was kind of wording things so uh, I didn't upload it so um, I might upload it just with uh, music playing but it might look really weird so um, anyway but I did strip her today and uh, got quite a few ba uh, eggs uh, three that were bad so um, if they make it uh, they will be uh, fish food um, I do not plan on selling them I don't like hybrids I don't even like when I see on Craigslist uh, people trying to sell um, hybrids in that um, of African cichlids. So, um, but uh, angelfish are leaving next week. Um, maybe Saturday I might be getting another tank. I haven't quite made up my mind because um, I kind of need another tank for the baby plecos. Uh, I got about, I think I count 17 or more baby plecos with the albino uh, dad and the 10 gallon. Um, and uh, they're doing well. <clears throat> they just started eating today. Um, so, uh, but yeah, I uh, haven't quite made up my mind. As you can see, everything, I mean, no one's, the only thing that's going on right now is the fact that my yellow, uh, lab is getting picked on by the other Labochromus, but I mean, there's no fighting, there's no bickering, um, so everything's at peace here. Um, I'm really hoping it stays like that when I add the two goofballs in. Uh, I might get rid of the Savrum, uh, just because he's getting big, and, uh, He's doesn't like the uh, peacocks so good, so but we'll see. Um, but yeah, love this guy, sunshine peacock, really pretty. It was either him or um, another peacock that was like all black. Uh, well, not black, but a dark blue, really dark blue. And um, of course, there was one other peacock I could have got, but he looked too much like the red shoulder, so. Um, side against him. Also I saw a um, full colored up bicolor male, full grown, and I uh, can't wait until my bicolor gets that size and that color. Um, he looked cool and very nice. So uh, yeah, um, soon the stack might change a bit. Uh, that um, yellow lab female's leaving and also the other female yellow lab, wherever she is, oh there she is, um, she is leaving, um, just because they, all they do is chase each other, they don't harass the other fish, they just chase each other, and it's driving me nuts, so, um, the only one that is staying that I'm purposely have, having stay, um, or no, she's gone, I can't, you guys can't see her, uh, is the, <coughs> Labochromus, uh, non, the other species of Labochromus, that is not a yellow lab in here, um, which is right there. So, um, because uh, she keeps my <clears throat> female solosa in line, um, and uh, I'd really uh, would hate for my female solosa to start picking on the bigger guys. So that is why she's in here. So that's why I'm keeping her. Um, but for the most part, everything, everybody gets along. So, hopefully everybody gets along when I add the two other goofballs back in here. <clears throat> so, 
um, sorry for such a late update. Uh, it's been hectic over here, so. Alright, I'll, uh, keep you guys updated on everything, and, uh, I personally can't wait until I get the third game up and running. So, yeah, sorry for the long video. Peace.